So these are the uh, source files for Lively Kernel. And one that's of key importance is example.htaccess because it has a directive in it which helps you set up webdav, which is the persistence mechanism you're going to want to use if you use Lively Kernel. Um, without webdav, Lively Kernel is not very useful. And here's why. If you go to uh, a code browser and you look at the code, you're going to say to yourself, I want to program, I want to make changes. Um, but without WebDAV, your changes won't be any good. Like you can change the code here, you take out that silly comment, and then you'll want to accept it, but nothing will get accepted, nothing will get saved. You can't build anything without any persistence. You need WebDAV. But here's something we can do. We can do some uh, Hello World type stuff. We get ourselves a text morph, and we can throw some code in there and... Uh, play with some morphs. So let's create a couple of points. Um, location equals point 100, 500. And then size equals point um, 200, 200. Then we make space or get a, an extra line. M equals new text morph. location.extent size comma hello world so we've created a morph but now we need to put it on the world which is the background there so world morph current add morph m <clears throat> and we highlight that and we do it Look at the fantastic changes. No, I'm kidding. We have to go over here, and we've created ourselves a new morph. And we can uh, pick that up by grabbing it and drag it over to um, here. And we can try something a little different for the new morph. We'll change these uh, points from location. Location point will now be 0, 0. And we'll change the size to 336 by 224. We'll make this an image morph now. We'll make this rect location size comma, and we'll add a path to a file that came with the source code. Resources, images, Halloween4.jpg. And that's all we have to do. Now we just highlight that and do it. And then we've got an image on the world. Like that. We can grab that and move it around. So that's uh, Hello World in Lively Kernel.